John Hutchison, born October 19, 1945, is a Canadian inventor known for the Hutchison Effect alternative energy devices, life extension projects with vitamins, Navy ship dismantling restoration of machine tools his sense of humor mostly and acting abilities as seen as his character Carla Nipshin and others who are featured in films and radio shows. John Hutchison has been features on over 300 TV shows and over 1,000 radio shows as some shows are listed but not all can be listed here. 1957 John attended North Shore College to grade 12 then a private tutor. 1965 John made hydrogen balloons and let them off over Vancouver, Canada. This event caused a stir as Vancouver folks reported the sightings and the news media showed up and headline news was made. 1969 John helped out in Riverview Hospital as a janitor and other adventures. 1970 John started his gun museum in North Vancouver 1998 John started his anti-gun control cases with full support of gun owners and Prime Minister Joe Clark that involved the press and news media's BC TV Allen Edwards newspapers and radio Mike Winlaw of the Vancouver show 1979 October John won his gun control cases and the Canada and laws covering firearms had to be changed 1980 Hutchison effect was discovered by John Hutchison and promoted by George Hathaway to USA Army Intelligence and Security Command 1983 John B. Alexander General Bert Stubble Dean, the Reagan administration and as well Prince Hans Adam II Lichtenstein, and as well as Canada Deputy Prime Minister Eric Nielsen who brought in Dr. Lorna Quinn 1986 through Director of Scientific Technical Intelligence then again to McDonnell Douglas in each presentation extensive videos were taken of the effects that caused levitation of anything at a distance randomly and changed metals into other unknown alloys and twisted them 1986 John is a guest of Expo 86 at DC Place Stadium radio announcements and showing off his vintage Tesla reproduced devices 1986 October John meets Tesla's friend Thomas Lee Richardson who had a house full of Tesla's papers and furniture the government seized all this on the death of Thomas to send to relatives in the UK that were tested over the years by national labs and Germany labs 1986 John joins the spur program of the USA government 1987 John left the promoters and went out on his own with a group from Boeing as well as TV demonstrations and John left all promoters in 1989 John left Canada for Germany with his lady in Gazda from Hollywood 1991 John returned to Canada where John and Yin traveled to Japan as featured guests hosted by TV Asia John TV and other places to show demonstrations of alternative energy devices to news medias and feature on TV shows TLC TV. Discovery Channel Fox TV NBC TV and 1994 Dennis Weaver Awards John Best Hardware Presentation at the Denver Conference held at the Stanley Steamer Hotel while at the same time Dumber and Dumber was being filmed the actor joined in and John was interviewed for PBC Tesla Film by National Productions 1995 John's Lady Returns to Hollywood 1995 John starts working for the Artificial Reef Society dismantling Navy ships armaments and electronics two of the warships were used in this files DOD Common Endgame 1995 Ken Shoulders presents John's discoveries to MIT along with his own work John's second trip to Japan with Dr. Brian O'Leary paid form the Japanese later John builds power cells for the Japanese 1997 John is a guest with the Star Trek folks on a month-long lecture in Los Angeles attending was the jet propulsion scientists Larry King Ken Shoulders and Herman Zimmerman gave John a tour of Paramount Motion Pictures Star Trek sets later John meets Prince Alfred von Lichtenstein with Ian Gasta and Henry Dake in 1999 John films entertainers in Los Angeles and as well DD a number of TV interviews for Fox TV and TLC Beyond Productions John was a guest at Steven Siegel's home in Dennis Weaver Beach House at Malibu Beach 2000 John works on the last Navy ship HMCS Yukon and starts more TV shows with TLC TV Strange Science 2000 2001 John is a guest with Art Bell radio show host and John as well hosted a few radio shows 2001 John gets interviewed for Fox TV and Jim Cherry of Miramax Motion Pictures and many other TV show interviews 2002 John meet ex-congressman Berkeley Battle in person in Vancouver 2003 John connects with Boyd Bushman of Lockheed Martin 2004 John starts on the Ark of the Covenant revealed one hour long Discovery Channel show and also starts with Griffin production on Beyond Invention pilot New Energies 2000 6 USA Pentagon Group shows videos of the Hutchison effect and offers a work opportunity for John who declines the offer and was interviewed for more TV shows NGTV Bermuda Triangle and others later this year John meets Congressman Dennis Kushinik in person in Vancouver 2007 John gets married and same year divorced same year John was interviewed by four History Channel's Earth Black Holes Polar Shift Films CNN TV Japan 
2008 early March John is a guest on Paris Hilton BFF show years after he met Miss Hilton later in 2008 discussions of John's motion picture and TV say yes by film producers in Vancouver and Los Angeles were going on and I think it's still up in the air. 2009 John leaves Vancouver to meet Nancy who made a number of films with John 2010 John sells his anti-gravity lab to a German research team who in 2007 for two weeks filmed the Hutchison effect and this is downloaded onto YouTube John leaves Canada with Nancy to use technology in helping cleaning up the Gulf oil spill 2011 John meets Jesse Ventura from True TV they work on Death Ray interview John shows off his laser and his ray gun for filming by Jesse and crew same year John marries as Nancy 2012 John and Nancy moved to the Oregon coast to set up the research facility to reverse radioactivity and explore new energy as well. John wants to open up a arms museum to add to this. Me, the author, have cases of papers, books, and cases of videos and letters, pictures documenting this interesting bio, and this bio only covers a small portion of events. A book was attempted by George Hathaway called Mind Benders on John Life. It's maybe worth reading but poorly done. But another book by Nick Cook of Jane's Defense Weekly called The Billion Dollar Secret I feel is better to read. And Nick Cook as well had a documentary 2001 for TLC TV. This author myself find it a challenge to list everything but at least it's the truth and without prejudices.